Welcome to a beautiful day down here at Fisher O Harbour. Now it's Saturday and as you know on Saturdays I always come down here for a coffee and to chill out after a busy week in the marketing industry. But today it's different. Today is Fisher O Harbour Festival Day. That's right, they've got kiddie rides, they've got shops, they've got emergency services vehicles, there's even a bus here as well. There are stalls and there are food trucks. It's going to be really exciting and later on this afternoon they're going to do a lifeboat demonstration right here in the sea by the harbour. So I thought it'd be really interesting to come down here today and to do a vlog. And guess who's here? Look! Hey! hey it's Mrs E. Are you ready for this? Yes. Oh, I tell you what, it's going to be a really good afternoon and I think we should say it, shouldn't we? Yep. Are you ready? Yeah. Welcome, Welcome to, to Rog Vlog! <laughs> Fisheroe Harbour Festival happens every May, but as you would expect, for the last two years it hasn't happened because of the pandemic. So it's great to be back and what an absolutely fabulous day for it. So looks like it's getting busy already, so let's take a walk through and see what we can find. So we're starting off with some children's rides. We've got the premiere shootout. <laughs> It was also got East Coast FM, the local radio station. I'm seeing nothing. Really cute little wave swinger. People going on the wave swinger now will be on the Star Flyer in Edinburgh come Christmas. What a beautiful day. Ooh. Donuts and churros over there. We're going to have to try out those churros later. Absolutely love churros. There's a fire engine from the local fire station and I think they're demonstrating their equipment. And then we've got some shops and stalls. This is great for the community. Everybody from Musselburgh, Fisher O' Sands have come along here today. Oh, it's such a great place to come down on a Saturday afternoon. Support the local community, support local businesses. Do you know what I'm really excited about, and this is really geeky, is, is that East Coast Buses bus. I'm going to have to go on that later, aren't we? Maybe they'll let me sit in the driving seat. What do you think? Is that a little bit too geeky to do? My goodness. Anyway, I think before we do anything else, we should go to Sizzler's and get ourselves a burger. to Fisher O Harbour is never complete without the famous Sizzler's Burger. So let's get stuck in. Fantastic, as always. <laughs> They're just playing Kelly Marie down there. Do you know that song from the 70s? It goes, boo, 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 boo. Unfortunately, if I went over there and filmed it, I'd probably get a copyright strike. How was your burger? It was really good. Not Michelin star, but very good. I really like the burgers from Sizzlers. As you say, it's, it's just a burger van, but it's one of the best burger vans in East Lothian. So I think we should go and have a really close look at what's going on. I am a child at heart so I'm gonna go on the miniature railway. Here we go! Miniature railway! POV! Exciting! It's not exactly the big one at Blackpool Pleasure Beach is it? But it's great fun! And now we're going to experience the ride all the way backwards.
And here's the festival mascots taking a ride on the train. They're called the Paw Patrol. I wonder who's inside those costumes? OK, it's a lot busier now, so let's have another walk around and have a look at the festival attractions in a little bit more detail. Ever been inside a fire engine? No, neither have I. Let's go. Well, I guess this is really supposed to be for the kids, but do you know what? I'm the biggest kid there is. I'm actually sat in a fire engine. <laughs> The Coast Guard equipment and vehicles are well worth a look as well. Well, this is Stuart, he's the harbour manager here at Fisher and what I bet you didn't know is that he was the one in the Paw Patrol costume on the train that I've shown earlier. I bet it's hot in there, Stuart. Sweating, <laughs> sweating. There was no clothes on. <laughs> You've got to multitask when you're the harbour manager down at Fisher Row. And this is Katie, and she's one of the trustees of the Fisher O Harbour Association. You said that as I got that wrong, didn't I? Fisher O the... Harbour and Seafront Association, but it was really good, Roger. Nice try, nice try. Nice try, I nearly got it. So, Fisher O Harbour and Seafront Association. That's it, that's it. And Katie's going to blow some bubbles for us. She's going to try, she's going to try. Are you ready? These guys are from the Eskimuth Rowing Club, demonstrating one of their skiffs. These guys offer a fitness workout on the water. We even have a bandstand. Over here during the day, we've got folk music, we've got brass bands, we've got ukulele bands, and later we're going to have a rock band. Well, there's quite a big queue to go on and explore this bus. So, as big a kid as I am, I think I'm going to leave it to the kids this afternoon. It won't be long until the lifeboat demonstration, so I need to go and find Mrs E. I think she's parked herself way over at the other side of the harbour, where things are a little less hectic. Let's go and see if we can find her. 
and take in the beauty of Fishero Harbour on the way. Well, I've been walking around doing all the filming. What have you been doing, Mrs E? Sitting here enjoying the sunshine. <laughs> Do you know, I think I'll join Mrs E and enjoy the sunshine for a bit. In a few minutes time, they are going to start the lifeboat demonstration. So this is probably gonna be the most exciting part of the afternoon. White Wing is a heritage fishing boat that's come all the way from the Scottish Fisheries Museum in Anstruther. Everyone involved in the rescue demonstration is starting to gather at the mouth of the harbour. Looks like this jet ski is going to be involved in some way. And we know that this yacht with the fabulous name of Swirly is also going to be part of the demonstration. the owner of Swirly rowing out to his boat and of course the RNLI lifeboat team ready to power up and skim out onto the sea. Here we go then, rescue number one. This little sailing yacht is about to get into danger. number two and it looks like Swirly is on fire. Once the lifeboat crew are happy that the fire is out, they go to check on the guy who escaped in the rowing boat. Notice how the guy in the rowing boat has set off orange flares to guide the lifeboat to him. And rescue number three involves the jet skier. Something's going to happen. Just look at him go.
rescued and reunited with his jet ski. And that is the end of the demonstration. The lifeboat heads back out to sea. Well, that was really exciting, but we're so thirsty and hungry. So we're gonna head towards that churros stand. And is it churros or is it donuts? Both. Both. <laughs> So we can either have churros, which is Spanish, Belgian waffles, or crepes. Now, I think I might go for crepes today. I've learned something today and I didn't know this but the churros van is owned by the same people who own Sizzlers it's Lisa and Justin and they have given us an absolute stack of sugar and uh, I was gonna say spice but it's definitely not spice it is just all sugar maple syrup and chocolate Nutella have a look at this How's it taste? This is going to be death by sugar, I'm telling you. Suzette, golden syrup, and even more sugar piled on top, and it's hot. I don't even know how we're gonna fit these donuts in. We've already had the crepes and the churros, but uh, here goes Nutella and even ching, more ching. sugar. <laughs> ching ching, cheers. <laughs> mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh, reminds me of growing up on Blackpool Pleasure Beach, this. Mm. We are going to have to do some serious exercise after all of this. Definitely. Serious, serious. <laughs> Time to relax for a bit now and listen to the rock band playing. Oh my god, that was far too much sugar. Sugar rush, sugar, sugar rush. rush. Well, all that golden syrup, all that Nutella, all that sugar, we are gonna have to go on a route march to work it all off. Nah. Nah, actually, I think we'll just go home <laughs> and put our feet up. Do you know, it's been really good down here at Fisher Row Harbour today. Beautiful weather, and the festival has been a massive, massive success. Crowds and crowds of people from the local community enjoying the sun and enjoying the festival. This has been a fabulous success. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Rog Vlog. And if you enjoyed the show, please do subscribe to my YouTube channel. In the meantime, remember there's always something to see. So okay. get out there and Bye. find it. And guess who's with me? Yay! Hey. It's Mrs. E. <laughs> you ready for this? Yes. Let's go into the harbour and, oh, we f***ed that up, didn't we? I can't believe that. So I'm going to have to let the children go first, even though I'm a big kid. I think, that was rubbish, wasn't it, Roger?